Here is the new latest Nike. Whoa. Look at this. Another damaged box by Nike. Yikes. Okay. Oh well. So let's open up. Damage box. Nike. This is from Belgium. Distribution center from Belgium. Anyway, let's open up. Another big haul. This was about, let's say, un just under 1K. $1,000. And here are some comparisons that I will show you in this video. All right. A lot of good stuff in here. Okay, first one is a Nike, it's a Jordan T. We'll get into details with that. This one's a Nike T, size medium. All of these I have a 25, a 20% off coupon. Another Jordan T with a bigger logo, size small. A long sleeve Nike T, long sleeve T for my buddy. I'll leave it to him. Uh, a short sleeve, another Jordan logo. This one's on the on the left side of your chest with the embroidered uh, jump man. We'll do some comparison. Uh, medium size T white Nike. I think that's for myself. Um, what else do we have? We have a pair of shorts with, uh, sorry, with a pair of joggers with the um, Nike, uh, the recycled material. Regular fit, tapered leg for my buddy. I'll leave it to him. What else do we have here? Another one for my buddy. Another pair of sh size medium. Oh, it's a jacket. It's a it's a uh, Air Max jacket, size medium. I'll leave it to him. That one is 150 bucks. About a Jordan Breakfast Club. A lot of the Jordan uh, BC products came up uh, in July, early Ju uh, sorry in June, early July. A lot of re really nice designs for the Jordan uh, uh, BC, Jordan BC, Jordan Breakfast Club. So it tells it's saying that. Jordan wakes up in the morning, you're doing a lot of workout in the morning, so that's why Jordan Breakfast Club, taking no breaks, wake up, waking up early. This one's a hoodie in blue, and let's see how much was it cost. The blue was uh, this one. Let's see, so the, the, jacket, the, the, the Air Max jacket was 136. The, the the trouser was sixty four. This one is sixty eight dollars. Anyways, keep going. Another pair of joggers for my buddy. This one is this one's sixty four dollars with the authorized personnel Nike. What else do we have? Another Jumpman. T-shirt. This one's the middle one, twenty-four dollars. What else do I have? A black Jordan Jumpman. Black one is also twenty-four dollars. That's for myself. I got a Mavs jersey, Luka Doncic, sixty-three dollars. I got a DeAndre, Andre Ayton, sorry, no, this one is Devin Booker, jersey, Suns jersey in purple, no logo here, but, uh, sorry, no picture here, but sixty three nineteen. not bad price for a jersey, don't know if I want to keep it, but just bought it for now, what else do I have, this one's a nice, oh, this one might be a keeper, I thought this would be like a screen printed, but it's actually embroidered. This one's a nice one. Uh, what the, What is this one called? Uh, this one is called... Uh, right there. $24. Swoosh League. $24. I might have to keep this one. This one's really nice. 
Uh, what else? Another a mini Jumpman, size medium. The small the small Jumpman is thirty three dollars, but this one is a dry fit uh, uh, material. So we'll do some comparisons after. Like I've been keep on saying, this one's a long sleeve Nike embroidered T shirt from my buddy. The long sleeve is. The long sleeve is $28 with my coupon. And another Jumpman. This one, again, the big Jumpman is um, $24. That's it. Oh, also a pair of shoes. The way that the box looks like, looks like it's been wet and someone's taped it up. It's been wet and someone taped it up because it broke. But uh, kudos, I guess it's uh, a FedEx. So kudos to them. They At least they taped it up so it doesn't break apart. And the shoe here is Kyrie Irvin. It's a Flytrap 5. Uh, how much was it? Here, I'll bring my... Flytrap 5 is 60, $68. I've, done, I've watched some reviews on it. People are saying it's not that great. I like, I do like the colorway. I do like the, um, again, the colorway is pretty nice. Here, I'll, I'll let you enjoy it. signature one i don't think i don't believe uh Ky Kyrie has been wearing this for uh for the actual games so i don't think i want to keep this for 65 i only have enough kicks um here i'll give it a try while we have it on Okay, let's see, there it is, looks nice, nice on feet, like the white color, um, it just feels, compared to the, I have a Kyrie 4, I think it was Kyrie 4, but this one looks, the inside looks really, does, I don't feel the bounce. From a quick try on. Anyways, moving on. This might be going back. Okay, so let's do the comparison. Um, let's put these aside. So here, here's the comparison bid for all the Jordan tees. I believe there's four. Uh, there's three types here. There's three types. This one is this. Nike T. Okay, three types. There you go. Um, okay, so um, we have. If you're looking for a Jordan's Jumpman T, the go to is basically this one with the embroidered because it's always nice to get the embroidery, just like on the shoes. Um, this one, again, is, uh, what is it? This one is, the embroidered one is $28, $28. Uh, this one is not dry fit. And then this one's the screen printed one for twenty-four dollars. Um, let's open up and sh and try to feel the material in a sense. 
Okay, so let's get the mediums out. So these are all the same with the screen printed. This one's the smaller mini one, mini logo, but it, this is one is actually the most expensive dry fit. So open up and see what the difference really is. What is up with all the price difference? Okay, so this one is a size medium. Um, small jump man. It doesn't say dry fit. Oh, it says right here, dry fit. Right here. It's dry fit. Um, it's a, it's kind of loose for a medium size. Kind of loose fit. Most expensive one. And then let's try the, the, the next one. This one's, I think this was the cheapest one, the $24 one. $24. Let's open up and make a compare. Okay, this one also says dry fit though. This one says dry fit as well. And it's also loose fitting with the bigger jump man. So I guess just by the feel, they both feel the same. So ultimately, it's whether if you want a baby jump man, a baby jump man, or the big jump man. Which one would you like better, right? Um, price difference, this one's more expensive, this one's less expensive, 24 versus 33, I believe. Sorry, I'm losing, losing my track. Um, where is it again? Losing track, I, I'm, I've been ordering too many. Yeah, the small one's 33. 33, 34 versus 24. There's a $10 difference between the size of the Jumpman, basically. That's what it comes to. Let's go down, keep going. Um, let's do this one. This one's probably my favorite. I might keep this one. This one's again, $24. $24, oh, sorry, $28, $28. So um, this one is probably, Dry fit as well, size medium. They ran out of the white, the white ones. So I got a black one just to compare. Just by the feel of it, I, I, I like this material. I don't know because it's black. It doesn't say dry fit here though. No dry fit. But the logo on the side looks better than the ones in the middle. Um, this one, $28 made in Cambodia. These ones are made in Malaysia. And this one's made in Egypt. So the Egypt one is the lowest price. Then comes the made in Cambodia, 28. And then the most expensive one, the 34, made in Malaysia. So, I mean, in ultimately your choice. You want you want screen printed. You want embroidery. I would choose the middle one, twenty eight. And then I probably don't. I don't. I don't like. The, actually, I don't like the Jumpman being too big. I like it actually smaller. But this one's too expensive. I'd say, in my opinion. Anyways, there you go. Enough about those jerseys. Uh, those tees. Let's check out the jersey. Luca jersey. There you go, Luca, size medium, dry fit material, Luca. To be honest, I've been, I have not watched most of his game, but he is one of the front runners, one of the face of the NBA. So definitely a good keeper for that price, $64. Booker as well, one of the face of the NBA. For sixty-four dollars, this one has a jump man. This one has a swoosh. So the swoosh one is is not the seventy-five anniversary. The seventy-five anniversary jerseys have the actually the bu the bubble that comes up. So there's the the Booker jersey. Uh, Booker jersey is made in Thailand. 
and also the mm -hmm. Luca jersey is made in Thailand. I like it. I like the look of it. Um, I don't know if I want to keep it. Probably, probably Luca. I don't know if I want to keep this Booker one though. We'll see. What do you think? Comment, like, subscribe. I think that's all we have. Um, so we'll see you next time. This one's kind of a long video. We'll see you next time.